Aqua. How can we get to live in better conditions than the people in the shanty town? How is that possible? Pure probability. Geographically and demographically, we were born in the right place at the right time. They weren't so lucky. Right. Wow, oh, they really don't seem to want us to go. No. But considering the amount of time... Whoa. You okay? Yeah, just a bit startled. Are they insane? They're not helping anyone by trying to hurt us. Don't they understand that we're doing this to save them? Those people will be on the MPT waiting list until the day that they die. You saw the WSA using so many resources to send four people to space? You'd be angry too. They don't understand. But when we bring the Arcs back, they will. Oh, they won't. I mean, they might, and I hope they do, but we're promising something that might not happen, even if we do bring back the Arcs. Hope springs eternal in the human breast. That's the way I choose to view it. Alexander Pope. The soul uneasy and confined from home dreams of a life to come. Look at you knowing your poetry. What can I say? I'm not just a pretty piece. Okay. <laughs> Take a look at this view. It's a shame we couldn't build her properly. What? With all the shortages of materials, it really is a miracle that this thing is here at all. You could have mentioned this in all these months of prep that were flying economy class? No, I didn't want to worry you. Except for right before taking off. Seemed only fair to disclose it now? Sure, sure. If Claire believes we can use her for the mission, we should trust her. I believe Zephyr 3 will handle the mission just fine. You know what I still think about? 